Hey guys, been a Papa John's delivery driver for about two weeks now. I don't know if you can make it out, but there's my uh, thing. It's not really making up very well, but that's it on top of my minivan. You don't see a lot of minivans uh, delivering pizzas, but uh, man, that's the beast right there doing the work. That thing up there, it doesn't just say Papa John's. It's actually a GPS tracker as well. So they grade me while I drive. And that gets tricky because if you speed, they ding you points. If you accelerate too fast, if you brake too fast, if you take turns too fast, all these little things will ding your grade. And of course, if you fail, you can't be a delivery driver anymore. So my first delivery, I got like a 78. And when I came back, my general manager was like, don't get to a 69. So the good news was I watched my driving. And by the end of the night, I averaged out a 90. So hey, all you high school kids, you know, even an old man has to get his grade up from a 78 to a 90. Uh, but I did. Papa John's delivery driver here in Texas makes a whopping $4 an hour. Uh, but of course, I get tips. Uh, now, unfortunately, some people don't give you tips. And that does suck, because then you're just driving around for four bucks an hour but uh, some people are also generous uh, a good tip is anything you know five dollars or above and we do need those tips because like I said some people don't tip so you got to average out to at least three or four dollars to make this job really worth it because I can only make two or three deliveries an hour uh, some of the deliveries are close but some of the deliveries are on the outer edge of our service and those deliveries can take 20 25 minutes to get to which means I'm 25 there, I'm 25 back. Sometimes it's in an apartment complex, you gotta find the apartment, get up to the third floor, whatever. Uh, and then of course, if you get back and they don't tip, that's you know almost an hour of your life that you were just hanging out for four bucks an hour. Inside the Papa John's behind me, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, uh, if you're not delivering, you have to do things like man the oven, box the pizzas, make sure they have the right sauces, uh, cut them. Uh, I don't do much of the making of pizzas, but they do have me do that sometimes if necessary. Uh, I do have to make sure the labels are correct, uh, the orders are correct. Um, of course, folding boxes is endless, you know, cleaning things up, uh, making sauces, all those things are part of the job. If you want to become a Papa John's delivery driver, it's not a bad job. It will put miles on your car. They do give me 20 cents a mile. So as long as gas is cheap, that's pretty good, actually. Um, if you have a you know, <laughs> a vehicle that gets better miles to gallon than a minivan, uh, that 20 cents per mile actually works out pretty well for you. Uh, for me, it works out just about right if gas is two to three dollars a gallon. Uh, right now, since gas prices are cheaper, it works out better for me. Uh, but obviously, the better mileage you're going to get, uh, the better that'll be for you. All right, guys. So now you know about the life of a delivery driver. All right, say your prayers and don't touch your face.